Let's start with setting our blueprints. Number one is for the front view. Number three is for side view. Number seven is for top view. Now on this, just your blueprints, duplicating them a few times for each angle. Create a plane, move it to the hood on the blueprint, get rid of the half of it, add mirror modifier and don't forget to click on clipping option there. This option sticks our vertices on the center where it's mirrored. Also we will need a subdivision modifier. Don't forget to use all view angles to adjust your geometry as precise as you can. When you finish the part, add solidify modifier. Put it between mirror and subdivision surface. Turn on even thickness and only rim options. Do it with every next part you will do. Uh, it's not necessary for parts like headlights or maybe glass, but it's necessary for body. Of the car. Some tips on how to switch between different parts. For example, when you finish the hood, just copy the vertices with Shift D where the bumper starts and with Ctrl P, separate it and continue working on it. Better not to do everything as one object, because it will be problematic to do all of those caps between parts. The secret of good geometry is time you put into it. The more stuff you do with your hands, the more you understand how geometry works and how some objects should be done. It's just a game in experimenting, making mistakes and learning. Don't worry if your first car takes too long to make. I had spent around a month for my first car. If you have doubts about your geometry, you better find some real photos as a reference. But don't worry if that car looks a bit different in real life. Cars can be changed in real life as well. So imagine that you're just modding 
your own car and make it as you wish if you can. To create a wheel I used a photo reference, which I inputted in Blender. This process is hard. Imagine that you divided a wheel in pieces. In my case it was some kind of Y shape. Later those pieces will be duplicated with dedicated for this tool. After I duplicated it 360 degrees, I had to make some changes to the vertices to merge them.
I made the tire with circle that was extruded because I had a texture for a tire. But usually they are made a bit different way, which I'm not gonna show you because it requires a lot of polygons, which is not good for your render times. For headlights you will definitely need a reference image, mostly there are not much of accurate recreation of real model, uh, the main thing is to make it look good, so just try to add as much details as you can. Quick tip on how to make windows fast. Create a plane, delete the half. In snap tool choose faces. Add mirror modifier, then subdue. Pressing Ctrl you can snap selected vertex to any surface. All this will help you to make the glass really fast. Thanks for watching, I know it was not the best explanation tutorial, but mostly tips on how to improve your modeling skills. But if you want more tutorials with more complex geometry and better explanation, you can show your support with likes and subs. Also we have a Patreon, where you can support this channel for future videos. And there will be serious materials from tutorials as well.